In this video, I'll be explaining the differences between the sensors and tracking of the Oculus Rift S and the original Rift CV1. For impatient people, here's the TLDR. If you have a long-term, well-placed three-sensor setup, the Rift CV1 is better. If your room is smaller or finding good spots for external sensors is hard for you, then the Rift S is better. Now here's the pros and cons of each one. The normal Rift comes with two sensors for in front of you, which work great until you turn around and they lose sight of you. But, if you get three, and they're properly placed, you'll have pretty much perfect 360 degree tracking. The main problem with external sensors is finding the right place for them, which can be hard for some people based on their room setup, and they can be pretty sensitive about their locations. Also, you need a USB slot for each sensor, which kind of sucks, but whatever. The Rift S has its sensors on the headset, which works great as long as the controllers remain within line of sight. This makes the Rift S a lot more portable, and you can use it pretty much anywhere with a computer. And it only needs one USB port for the sensor. The Rift S sensors also provide video feedback to the headset when you walk outside your play area, which will be a major improvement for normal Rift users who never learned how to lift their heads and peek through the nose hole to get around their room. Now here's where the Rift S tracking falls short. If the headset loses line of sight to the controllers for too long, it'll stop tracking. Like if you turn your hand upside down and block the controller sensor ring for more than a second or two, it loses tracking. It generally handles tracking behind you pretty well, but if you move your hand too far back or directly behind your head, it can lose sight of you. In conclusion, both headsets have great tracking in general, but you should consider the differences when choosing to buy or upgrade. Please rate the video, leave your thoughts in the comments, and subscribe if you want to see more. And thanks for watching.